Please activate the subtitles. My name is Roger Kala and this video is definitely going to be different because I'm going to talk about video game and if you're not interested in video game and I believe that most of my subscribers are not interested in video games uh, I recommend that you watch this video anyway because you might learn some new expressions and some new vocabulary we never know and I'd like to share with you something that happened to me today it has just happened to me something named Momentum yeah I was playing FIFA you know, and I play different games. I really love playing video games. I play Far Cry, I play Brutal Legend, uh, The Last of Us, and among other games, The God of War, so on and so forth. And I was playing FIFA, and something named Momentum happened. Okay, I'm gonna explain what Momentum is. Uh, the FIFA community calls Momentum, or scripting, the idea that under the hood, FIFA creates dramatic moments by giving the losing team a helping hand or making life harder for the winning team. Uh, basically, according to hundreds of people who play FIFA, and if you play FIFA, you're gonna confirm that. Sometimes, FIFA helps the losing team by making the winning team much weaker than they should be, and it happens all of a sudden. So you're winning the match, and all of a sudden your players become dumb. They can't walk, they can't pass the ball, they can't do anything. Have you lost inexplicably while playing FIFA? Have you ever considered an equalizer to an opponent who all of a sudden turns it on in the last second? Do your players decide they've had enough or and run as if they're stuck in the mud? Have you ever experienced a situation that you're winning, you're winning the match, and then your players start stumbling on each other, you pass the ball to a player on the right but the ball goes to the left, or you shoot the ball towards the goal 17 times in a row and your ball hits the post 17 times in a row. Has it ever happened to you? Yes, yes, I'm a little bit angry. I'm a little bit angry because something happened to me. Something has just happened to me. <laughs> Most FIFA players will remember times when the game has done something that doesn't seem fair. Alright, you might say, Oh, but this is football and crazy things like that happen in real life too. In real football too. Okay, I was playing FIFA now. And this happened. Take a look. But I'm gonna give you context. I was playing Seasons. Uh, you know, I was playing the Seasons and I'm in the first division. I only needed to win one match in order to be champion. Yes, I just needed three points to be the champion of the division, which is the hardest division ever. It's the first division. But the thing is, I only had one match left. I had to win because I needed three points. Okay, I was winning, I was winning. I scored in the first half. I was playing so well that I had 80% of ball possession and my ball hit the post exactly 10 times during the match. It was unbelievable. But okay, I wasn't angry because I was winning. 1-0. Then the match should be over. Because the 90 minutes had passed. And for no reason at all, my player conceded a corner kick. I passed the ball to the player on my right, but my player just turned around and kicked the ball out of the pitch. Remember, it was already the 90th minute. After that, my team considered exactly 7 corners in a row. After the 90th minute. And you will say, Oh, but things like that happen in real life too. In real soccer too. But does this happen in real life too? In real life football? Take a look at this. Take a look at this. I was playing with Manchester and my defender, this guy with uh, the black power, he just disappeared and then Robin was free to score. Look again. <laughs> my defender could have pressured Robin in order to avoid the goal, but no. Instead, he decided to vanish in thin air. Tell me, is FIFA scripted or what? Is momentum a reality or what? Well, I'll definitely buy pairs tomorrow. Pro Evolution Soccer. But don't worry, I'm not really angry. I just wanted to get it off my chest, as I said in the beginning of the video. And I've got a message for you, EA. I'm pretty sure that you're losing thousands and thousands of players every year because of this concept you've had of making the game more dramatic. I don't want dramatic games. Nobody wants that. We want a fair game and we want the best player to win. That's all. Well, thank you very much for watching this video. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, like our page on Facebook, follow me on Twitter and on Instagram. And thank you for listening to my rant. <laughs>
if you want to have classes with me please send me a message and we can talk about availability and prices thank you very much for everything and i'll see you next class oh and please please leave a comment telling me whether you play video games and which games you play or if you used to play video games which games you used to play and if when you play a game and something unfair happens do you really feel bad do you really live the moment as if as if that thing were real because I do. When I play video games, I really feel that that thing is real and I feel like, what? But um, I'm not really angry, you know. I'm not angry. Please click the big red button to subscribe. It really helps me when you do that. And click the bell to allow notifications so you will never miss new videos. Thank you very much. Thank <laughs> you.